Hello everybody, this is GameFG27 and welcome back to part 2 of LEGO Racers, the playthrough. Um, I'm happy to see the nice comments on the previous uh, video. Wait, uh, yeah, we go to build, right? Um, I think we have like a new... Yeah! We're just gonna steal his car. <laughs> gonna steal Redbeard's car. Anyway, I'm happy to see the nice comments on the... Uh, previous episode. Lots of people uh, see this game as being very nostalgic, and of course I can say that too. Um, we're gonna go straight on with... There's actually... What? There's Circuit Race, Single Race... That So you can choose to play just one race? Versus Race... But... What's the different... I don't know. Time Race. Okay, so it's... Yeah. I, I don't... I still don't... I don't actually remember what the difference is between Single Race and Versus Race. Um, we're gonna go to circuit number two, Tribal Island Trial, or Royal Knights Raceway, Ice Plant Pathway, Amazon Adventure LA, uh, hosting champion King Kahuka. Am I gonna have to do this guy's voice or something? Because the subtitles won't show up on screen, I'll try to... I don't even know. Me, King Kahuka, beat you like tribal drum. <laughs> and do victory dance. Ook, uh, ook, ook. <laughs> oh, there we go. Okay. <laughs> Alright, here we go. I'm happy I could solve a recording problem because uh, I was having some issues actually getting this episode recorded because uh, NVIDIA Shadowplay didn't like to record. It just didn't like to start. I've been having... I've had major problems with uh, NVIDIA shadow play for a long time now it's like like i mean <sighs> um nvidia is good at making uh gpus but that's really only the thing they're good at oh yeah i remember there being a shortcut here <laughs> no i need a green block green no where are there any green blocks in this track oh over here wow all right i guess at this point the I, at this point the people notice that if we put too many green blocks on the tracks they will only be used as um, as warps. So I guess they started removing the green blocks at this point. Um, I think that really is the only green block on this track. So, uh, you know, let's not take the shortcut this time. Let's go around the normal way. Because last time I did three, uh, like a shortcut three, three out of three times. What about showing just the normal track, actually? All right, I hope it's still green, actually. I don't remember. No, it's not green anymore. I, re I remembered that being a thing, actually. Uh, no, this is... I don't... Are there no more greens in this track? Like, if colors change randomly, then we might be able to see a green one later on. Really? They removed all the green blocks. Alright, then. Um, yeah, I can't find any green. Well, I guess we'll be uh, not warping to victory anymore like last time. Um, here we go. Yeah, this is... I don't... I don't know. This item... This uh, this this power-up is actually pretty funny. Yeah, I mean... Oh, I think if I pick it up now, it will probably ch change into a green one next lap, but... No! It changed into a yellow one. I, I don't even know. Anyway. <laughs> we finished anyway. Let's go to the next... Hello? Do we just wait? Oh, we just wait. Yeah. Um... Oh, this castle track. I vaguely remember this. Oh, I didn't get starter boost. I'm so bad. All right, die. <laughs> Slaloming. Nope, I missed. Oh, this. Oh, this means I get stuck here. Um, I don't remember if the track had the shortcut. Yes, I do. <laughs> yes, I do. All right, we need to get one uh, white brick now. Oh, don't want to get another color. All right, here we go. There was another green one over there. Um, no! No! <laughs> uh, I thought I could press the button before I was hit by that. Um, so yeah, there is a track later on. I don't quite remember it anymore, but... Oh my god, I'm doing so bad. There was a track later on, which actually has no shortcut. And I believe like every track in this game has a shortcut, except for that one, I think, if I'm not mistaken. That's part of like the modding community, so I heard a bunch of things about this game. I should have gone for the shortcut, actually. Never mind. There's like three green, if uh, three white ones over here. But um, um, there's that one track that doesn't actually have a shortcut, 
Um, but if you look at the game's files and look at the positioning of some objects, you can see that there were some changes made to the track, and it's likely that the track originally would have a shortcut. All right, I want to I want to keep this green. Okay, there we go, and let's go. I think. I should really look up uh, the stuff there again because I think there's quite a few things you can, kind of a few interesting, interesting uh, bits of information about this game. Just like the marker we like unused hidden stuff or something, like places you can see the tracks were kind of patched up. Like there used to be something there, but they like poorly fixed it up or something like that. Um, let's just use boost here. We're gonna fit. They're gonna win. Yeah, that's a homing rocket. What? Okay, that exists. I remember there being like um, a um, I don't know what to call it, slingshot type of thing. I want to try that one because I use I uh, I think you can like pull yourself forwards on other other characters. I don't know if it works on walls because that would actually make you speed up for when you're trying to do like blow up shortcuts and stuff like that. Let's see if I can get a red one. Give me a red block, please. I want to test something out. Um, I think it only works on other characters, actually. Yeah, it only works on other characters. Never mind this. All right. So this is a very obvious shortcut that I would always take as a kid, because because why not? And then you can take the green, and we off we go. Boom. Oh yeah, and you gotta watch out because you gotta turn at the end of that. It basically skips the entire spiral section there. I should probably go through it once just to show what it looks like. And yeah, I'm always drifting. Like the, if you use normal turn, it uh, just it's such a wide turn. I always drift anyway. All right, let's take normal rats this time. Okay, just gonna show you the tracks. I don't think I don't even remember driving on this section. I always take the shortcut. Actually, it looks like the shortcut. I don't know if the shortcut's really that much faster, to be honest with you. And, yeah, this would be the spiral that you skip. Ooh. And you'd end up back over here. Let's just use this. Oh, I actually picked up a white one right as I entered the uh, the warp. Alright. That's actually pretty useful. Actually, that might be useful, like, using the warp right, right in front of a block. If there's a good block right in front of you, you might as well... You might as well, right? Like, if I, for example, wait until... Oh, there was a green one on there as well. Oh, whoops. So if I use this right in front of the green one, I can pick it up, then land, and then... Oh, I would land in a green one anyway, but I could just boost away to victory. <clears throat> Great item management. Uh -huh. Alright, can we skip this? I don't think there's any way to skip this. No, I don't... No, there's no way to skip. Just, just have to wait, like... 30 seconds. All right. Man, this is nostalgic, dude. All right, there's a shortcut on the left here into the waterfall. Also, this is another track where I just don't remember ever like playing the uh, normal route. And then you'd always go for this and then activate in the corner. <laughs> oh, I could have picked up. Oh, I could have picked up a bunch of stuff. All right. I should just try the normal route. <laughs> Seriously, as a kid, I I, I don't I, I never took the normal route. Just to be honest with you, I don't remember ever taking this route. What's over here? You just drive downhill into the cave here. All right, I don't remember ever seeing this. All right, let's you get the green one. Whoa, okay. <laughs> and then, I think there might be a few white- No! I need green. I lost the green item. Hmm. Item or block power up, whatever you want to call it. Well, uh, this sucks. This sucks. Um, I'm just gonna head over here. Eh. This is definitely faster. I need green. I'm gonna use it right there so I get a white block. Oh boy. And then... Yes, yes, we can use another warp. Eh, there we go. Boom. Well, 
That's that for this track. Good stuff. Actually pretty funny trying to... Pretty interesting trying to find like the right like item strats actually. Since if you know where the item boxes are, or item, well the blocks. I mean this is not Mario Kart Wii. <laughs> Alright. We got first again. Who would have known? And who, I wonder who that is. Congratulations, you've won King Kahuka's car set. Yes, I did. You unlocked a new circuit. Okay. Let's actually have a look, like single race. So I can select the track from the GPs, but versus race, I, I don't, I don't get the difference. Let's just try one single race. I mean, what, what's that even do? I, but what's, what's the dip? What's the difference between that and versus race? What? Oh, two player. Oh, it's multiplayer mode. Oh, I wondered where that was. So versus just means like versus someone else. Ah, uh, time race. All right, that's uh, I, mean, I don't even know this character. I don't remember the name or anything. If we even know the name for that character. That's like the our time trial list. Yes, time trial <laughs> time trialing is a thing. <coughs> Oops, I didn't actually select my huh. I think we were able to like manipulate I think back in the day I noticed that we were able to like manipulate the time trials or make our own time trials. It's actually really simple, I think. I think it's just a path that it follows. I don't I wonder if it's a real I wonder, I don't remember. I think I swear that someone made like a program to like that records your position every every however much time and then it like saves into a file. Like as you can see, this ghost moves very like snappy because it's just a bunch of positions on the track saved and I think it just it just goes to the next to the next position and stuff. I don't know, it's interesting. It's completely different from what Mario Kart Wii uses. Mario Kart Wii saves your inputs and basically does it does a time trial back if you uh, replay your uh, uh, your ghost? It never saves your position. All right, so I guess that's that. Um, yeah, that's that for now. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Lego Racers. Next time we'll be going over circuit number three. Um, we got a few more. Actually, I just noticed that. Are we gonna be playing the same tracks over again? I think we are, huh? We're gonna be playing the same tracks uh, again, but more difficult. So I just noticed that. Um, anyway, that's it for now. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next video.